What is an intermediary? To Yandere chan, that's quite the question. For the longest time, she's never really known what it means to be connected to others. To feel connected. To feel happiness. To feel love. It all seemed so impossible for her to comprehend. Like an afterimage. Like a blur. Like a daydream. What is it like to love? To be happy. She never knew and for all that time she didn't seem to care. This knife and many others like it was something she knew too well. It was symbolic for two paths. A tool that reshapes and crafts on one side and a tool that destroys on the other. It used to be that the latter was the path more times than not. That was, until a fateful encounter came to her unexpectedly. The senpai whom she will always cherish. Not that he knows her feelings, of course. Since he entered her life, both paths were rendered false to her. Because these tools are her intermediaries. A bridge that links senpai to her own powerful feelings. Whether through cruelty or blood. A new rival. A girl by the name of Oka Ruto. The president of that sad bunch of delusional fools known as the Occult Club. I'd say it's just a phase, but that would assume Oka had the brains to figure out what is and isn't real. She even thinks those broads she keeps staring at are a couple of succubi. Poor girl. Yandere chan would have ignored her too, but apparently, Oka is after senpai. That can't be. That can never be. no choice. It is done. Senpai is free. For now. Little pile of heartbreak. But enough talk. Have at you. <laughs>